you guys and welcome back to my channel so today i am going to be stuffing both of my sinking fund binders along with my cash envelopes but before i get into this video if you are new to my channel and you are not currently subscribed to me i would really appreciate if you will take out the time to go ahead and click that red subscribe button along with the notification bell so that you will be aware of each and every time that i upload a video with that being said, let's go ahead and get right into it, you guys. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and start with the gold and white sinking fund binder. And the first envelope that we have is birthday. So today we are going to be stuffing birthday with $238. So we have 100, 200, 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, and 38 so let's go ahead and just check this one more time so we have 100 200 220 230 235 236 237 and 238 so 238 is going into birthday today and then in the next envelope we have christmas and christmas is going to be getting stuffed with 12 dollars. so we have 10 11 and 12 and then for homeschool homeschool is going to be getting stuffed with seven dollars today so we have five six and seven Next up, we have YouTube, and YouTube is going to be getting stuffed with seven as well. So we have five, six, and seven. And then we have giveaway. Giveaway is going to be getting stuffed with 15 today. So I'm just going to grab a 10 and a five for 15 and then for car maintenance car maintenance is going to be getting stuffed with 13 dollars today so we have 10 11 12 and 13 and also you guys i finally will be using my car maintenance maintenance envelope so i have a repair that's going to be done on my car well um if you watched my previous cash envelope stuffing video i mentioned in that video that i mistakenly and kind of cracked my side mirror so that is what this car maintenance is going to be paying for the dealership quoted me and they quoted me around 860 ish dollars so i need to get this to that amount quickly and then next up we have car registration and car registration is going to be getting stuffed with 13 dollars today so I'm going to grab a 10 and three ones. So $13 for car maintenance. And then for YouTube taxes, YouTube taxes is also going to be getting stuffed with $13. So we have 10, 11, 12, and 13 for YouTube taxes. And then for my cell phone, cell phone is going to be getting stuffed with 19. So I'm going to go ahead and grab a 10, a 5, and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Four ones. So my cell phone bill is actually due this month. I don't even know what exact day. So I actually need to go ahead and check that out once I'm done recording so I can make sure that I have my... Um, gold amount in there so that is going to be it for the gold and white sinking fund binder now we're going to go ahead and move on over to the black sinking fund binder and in this binder right here we're going to go ahead and be starting with my daughter's savings envelope so today she is going to be getting stuffed with seven dollars so we have five six and seven $7 
same thing for my son's envelope he is going to be getting stuffed with seven dollars as well so we have five six seven and then for mommy which is me i am going to be getting seven dollars five six seven and then up next is daddy which is my husband he is also going to be getting stuffed with seven dollars today so we have five six and seven okay and then next up we have vacation and today vacation is going to be getting stuffed with $25 so I'm going to go ahead and grab a 20 and a 5 for vacation and so those are all of the envelopes that are in my uh, black sinking fund binder so now we're going to go ahead and move over to my cash envelopes so for my cash envelopes, we're going to go ahead and see what we have left over. I do have my extra money envelope right here just in case we have some money that's left over. And then I also have my deposit back into bank envelope just in case there's some money that I need to deposit back into the bank. Okay, so the first envelope we have is going to be for groceries. And for groceries, looks like we have 20, 40, 50, 55, and 56 dollars. Looks like we have 56 dollars left over. So I'm going to go ahead and put that to the side. And we're going to be stuffing groceries today with 100 dollars. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. And then next up, we have eating out. And you guys, this right here, there is some money left in eating out, but it's actually not. So $5 is left in here, but this is eating out. We were over budget this month. I'm going to be honest. The budget um, for the week was $100, and we again went over budget for the eating out area so this right here this five dollars is just going to go back is going to go back into the bank account so yeah and today i'm going to be stuffing eating out with 100 dollars. so once again i'm going to work very very hard with us staying under the 100 dollar budget so it's going to be getting stuffed for 100 dollars this week so we have 20 40 60 80 100 And then next up, we have self-care. Self-care, I'm actually not going to stuff self-care this week. And then for haircut, my husband actually did get his haircut, but I forgot to give him this $20. So I'm going to put this $20 back into the bank account. And then I'm not going to stuff haircut today either. And then next up is spending money. For spending money, we have $30 left over. So we're going to put that into the extra money pile. And then today's spending money is going to be getting stuffed with 50. So we have 20, 40, and 50. And then for kids, I don't think I used any money from kids this week. So we have $50 in kids. I'm going to put this in the extra money pile. And then we're going to go ahead and stuff kids with 50 again. Now this week, I'm pretty sure that I am going to go out and get them. Because I want to get them some Crocs. So I think I'm going to get them some Crocs. So we're going to go ahead and stuff kids with 50. And then we have miscellaneous. Miscellaneous has $40. So this is extra. I'm going to go ahead and put that to the side. And I'm going to stuff miscellaneous with um, $40. And then for couponing, I know for sure that I didn't have to use any of my couponing budget. So I should still have my $50, which I do. So I'm gonna put this in the extra money pile and then I'm gonna go ahead and grab 50 more dollars. 
go ahead and stuff this with couponing. And then lastly, we have gas. I actually did put gas in my cart. I just forgot to use this. I used my um, card instead. So this right here is going to go back into the bank. And then I'm going to go ahead and stuff it again with this $100. I know you guys are probably like, why did you just... Why did you take the $100 bill out when you could have just kept that in? I know you guys, but I have to do it this way. That way I won't get mixed up. If that makes any sense. It may not make sense, but this is just how I do it. So, gas is going to be getting $100. And so, that completes this video, you guys. That wasn't too bad. So, I have both of my sinking fun binders um completely stuffed and i have my cash envelope stuff and so with my extra money this right here looks good you guys this is my all of my extra money for this week so this is really good so with the extra money um like i said i usually just put my extra money over here in um my extra money envelope and then with the money that needs to go back into the bank which is 125 dollars i'm going to just go ahead and put this in the um back deposit back into the bank envelope so that is going to be it for this video you guys i hope you all enjoyed if you did i would be very grateful if you will go ahead and give this video a thumbs up leave me some comments down in the comment section below um share this video with your friends and your family and i will see you lovelies in my next video bye